Welcome Builders, Andy is your here and welcome back to the very final episode, apart from maybe a cinematic, of Season 2, The Island. This is a medieval build using the 5x5 building system. If you like these kind of large projects, remember to hit that subscribe button, tap that notification bell. Hey, we are done. Just the last few details to tidy up in this episode. So I'm going to run around the whole island, look back at every single build, and there'll be a bit of a montage as well towards the middle or the end of the video. Now, this is the courtyard in the Royal District. So this is one of the very last little bits of time lapse that we're going to be doing. So I thought I would add in some barrel doors in the four quadrants, also some fountains, and also just a bit of greenery, maybe some trees could be added eventually, but definitely plenty of plants and kind of a nice sort of shaded, half shaded structure in the middle of this build. There we go, easy peasy. All right, now that that is done, let's just fly about the whole kingdom and see what other details we can put in just various places. I'm not going to get all the detail I would love to put into this. I just don't quite have the time. Sounds a bit crazy thing to say, but I have other projects to move on to in Minecraft. Do let me know in the comments what you think I should be building next. I would like another kind of a big project like this and try and get it done a bit more quickly. Try and get more episodes out. I've got plenty of time over December to do that. Okay, a nice little midpoint there to add some light. We don't really have any doors coming into this place down here, so let's make a little spooky secret door. Oh, tiny touch of lag there on my server. A little spooky secret door coming down and just bring this path down. It's good to get some first person building done on this series. I haven't done too much of it. It's been a lot of time lapse stuff. Let's just take away those two. Okay, cool. What else? Uh, where should we start? Should we just start right back at the beginning? Down on this area here, which is going to be our farming area. I did have a bit of a water accident before. And I do notice there's a heck of a lot of wheats here. Hmm. I think it's probably time to put some different crops down. I said I wasn't going to do much time lapse, but let's just, uh, yeah, let's just change this farm over a little bit. Okay, well that seems a lot more reasonable. Different food types being grown there and also I've added in here with the soldiers. I've got their own potatoes growing so people have got some food. Okay, let's just keep on checking everywhere. I think I could probably put in some extra trees into places like these nooks and crannies. Gonna add just a little bit more texture to the build by doing that. Oh, I've got a bit of a tree disaster right here. Slash SP Reaker 5. Let's get rid of this tree. I should have used the word area and not Reaker. Never mind. We're, we're on the task now. And I guess we'll just plant another one right here. Like that. Everything okay? So just double checking absolutely everywhere. This bridge looks okay. The flags look okay. Um, I could add a tree here. This forest looks good. We've got plenty of lighting around here as well. The hunters looks okay. The forester looks okay. The kelp dryer person, they look okay. We could put a tree here and here maybe. A little bit of lag right there. <laughs> there we go. Touch of server lag, never mind. Um, the sawmill looks okay. This bridge, I take it, looks fine. Got doors. Here's the sawmill right here. Um, bit of a meeting in there, a meeting of uh, <laughs> villagers. Stables looks okay. Got plenty of trees, doors. The fishing center looks okay. We've still got some fishing ships going out to sea. That looks okay. What about the dock? The dock looks busy, complete. A bit higgledy piggledy in there, but never mind. The warehouses. Still plenty of lights hanging about all over the place. Maybe we could add up just a couple more lights into places. 
lanterns, absolute game changer, whether you're building modern or medieval or just any style. What a beautiful, beautiful block. I love lanterns. It could be one of my favorite new blocks. I think stairs are always my favorite block because the stairs are so amazing. You use so many different things with stairs. Um, what's your favorite block in Minecraft? Let me know in the comments. Put my favorite block is, don't just like put prismarine or gravel. <laughs> gravel, why would gravel be someone's favorite block? That'd be funny. Yeah, my favorite block is gravel. I like the crunchiness. We've got a whole bunch of escaped animals down here. Okay, we could probably deal with escaped animals. We've got these weird steps coming down. Do you know what I haven't done? Is I haven't completed at all, at all, at all, at all, I haven't completed <laughs> this aqueduct here was supposed to fill a big tank of water. So that's maybe something we could do right now. Make a big tank of water. I think that's a nice task to take on right now for our last episode. The ducks are loving all this water. Okay, yeah, this could certainly be a tank. A tank of water. So let's do it like this. Get the world edit out. Stack this along. Uh, nine blocks should do it. Looking fine. Um, we'll get rid of all these. These, 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 these. You. And let's keep the corners. Sounded very Scottish there, doesn't it? Corners. Let's keep the corners. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Maybe this is not in a five by five pattern. Those villagers are very curious behind me. What is going on? Looking good. Okay, can we use world edit just to copy this across? Maybe we can, maybe we can't. Let's get rid of the glass. Sorry, duckies, your home is about to get maybe potentially better, to be honest. A big vat of water basically going to be put down here. Oh, what did I do? I used some Vauxhall Sniper there. That was that was pretty annoying. I don't want an arrow in my toolkit anymore, do I? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, is this in the right place? We need to make this bigger. Go big or go home. What was that? What was that noise? Are they making an egg into the water? And that's what made the noise. That's just weird. Okay, a bit of cliff. Out the way. <clears throat> okay, we've got that. Let me use some world edit to duplicate this side to the other side. Um, should be hopefully able to stand here and do it. Slash slash copy, slash slash flip, slash slash paste. Makes a nice mirror image on that side. Yep, pretty happy with that. And we can fill this in here. Slash slash fill five, which is the planks. They can go in there. And then we've got this side to do as well. Oh, do follow me on Twitch, by the way, because I'd be building my next project primarily on Twitch, which is a streaming platform free to watch. So do check me out. Do give me a follow on Twitch because that's where to find that's where to find me streaming. I'll also maybe do some weekend streams of city building, modern city building at the weekends. That looks okay for now, I guess. Let's just fill this in.
like that. And then if we get maybe a barrel looks good on the side, that would be down here, and then maybe some sort of tap represented by a hip wire truck, then we could put, oops, that there, and that could be the barrel for you to get your, well, that's a bit low. Let's have the barrel maybe potentially a bit further up. And that could be where you get your, your water. <laughs> what do you think? Ah, I don't know, I don't know. There we go. Okay, these little teeny tiny houses look okay-ish. This house is looking a little bit worse for the wear. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, what, what happened to this house? No idea what happened to this house. It got squished. Let's fix this house here. Well, we haven't got very far around the island. <laughs> and I'm finding job after job after job. Do check out my Patreon, guys, because you'll be able to download this house. This house? This house and the entire island downloadable on Patreon. Patreon.com forward slash Andy is your in Java edition and Bedrock edition. I'm playing it in Bedrock edition. It gives me the world edit tools that I need to make these kind of episodes and also the replay mod software, meaning I can do the time lapses. Okay, let's leave that house like that. I know I haven't finished off the sides, but that'll do That'll do for house right now. We can add in trees in certain bits. So we've got little town center looking okay. Teeny tiny market. I know, guys. Yeah, that's looking all right as well. Uh, this sort of medium quality housing district is looking fine as well. We've got the water coming down here as well. That all looks like that's working out as well. Fisher people's huts, we've got melons growing, uh, pumpkins as well. Let's add another tree. Here is the bamboo salesman, Weirdog himself, I'm pretty sure. Weirdog, the bamboo trader. <laughs> um, maybe we should get, uh, put in some more villagers. Maybe we need to do that. Is there a bed in here? If there's a bed in here, yes. There you go, that is Weirdog. Um, so here's the bamboo plantation. Pandas are still okay. Can we add one more tree into the llama park? The llama's still okay. Llamas are still okay. Always trying to escape. Here is the llamas building. Sheep building's looking okay. Do, 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 do. Got plenty of lighting. The berry guy or girl is here. Oh, that's a big, big tree. Oof. Did you see how big that became? Uh, the pigs looking okay. Add another tree here, another tree there. Double trunks. The, uh, the healer person. A bit of space here for another tree. Do, 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 do. The barn, Tronity's barn. Tronity the apple guy <laughs> and the orange guy, apples and oranges. Um, here is the milk person. All the cows, we've got a little bathroom here. Um, yeah, this place is this place is fine. I'm happy with that level. I'm happy with that level. Let's go on to the level above, which is this one up here, level uh, B. This is where most of the commerce, the trade is going to happen. This is where people who are smiths would work. Beekeepers, goldsmiths, tanners. Um, pretty good for detail not as detailed as if you were doing a conquest reforged map i suppose those guys are crazy that do that i just toured a castle with corrales on the darwin reforged server and the detail that duke on red put into his castle was just stunning so we've got a nice canal here running around nice shop signs the walls looking okay turrets we've got the brewers shop here making all the beer smelter across here smelting all the iron ore and we've got the miner no this is the stone stone cutter stone cutter here and we've got the miner here mining mining away uh, over here we've got I think what do we have this is probably the brick the brick maker 
Say hi to Mr. Brian, the brick maker. <laughs> Jacob Kreft. Uh, the, all these people who have got houses named after them, they've, they've made donations during live streams. Kraft the glazing. We've got the Cooper's house, guy making the barrels, in other words, Fletcher's house. It's all looking fine. Don't think I can add too many more trees. Oh, we could do with adding in this person's house. This person's going to grow the paper. The tavern's looking okay. The bakery, egg, cake and egg studios. The church is looking all right. Yeah, we've got something to do down here. Let's put a couple of trees in the garden here of the tavern. Oof, that tree's huge. That'll do. Uh, school's looking okay. A few houses over here. Maybe we could squeeze a few trees into the backyard of these houses here. Maybe we'll go back and build the sugar person's house, I feel. Yeah, that was looking fine. Let's just uh, think about level, completely finishing level B for a quick look around. And we'll go back into the sugar cane person's house. This dock's looking okay. The person who digs the clay, very tiny clay mine. Um, all this is looking okay. We've got houses, warehouses, amphitheater. Um, yeah, this is looking all fine. I think that's just probably the last thing we've got to do is check on that sugar person's house, the person growing the sugar cane. Maybe add a tree here, it would look good. This is level C, the rich person's district. We've got beautiful statues. Um, yeah, some spots here where we could add some trees right here feel. Probably here too. Statue up here. This is the bath house. Probably add one more tree right here. Looking mighty fine. Do, 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 do. Any more big trees to slap in here? Probably not. Maybe get one right down here. So the big hanging gardens of Babylon looking mighty fine as well. Really happy with all that. Uh, any trees to go up onto the top level? Didn't really put a tree into this bit, did I? I was thinking of putting a tree into here. I didn't actually get round to it. Do we need a tree? Let's try one tree in here. See what we get. See if we get a nice cool tree. Yeah, that's, that's fine. I like that. Maybe put one more tree over here, kind of opposite corner. Stand back. Yeah, that is that is cool. So they've got the rich palace up here. Rich houses. Yeah, I'm happy with the kingdom, guys. We could sign off on this. Let's go and build. I think Sue was very interested in making the suggestion of someone who grows all the paper down here. So let's time lapse this. It'll be the last time lapse of the series. Let's get this done. So this is the last build. Quick look at this, the paper merchant growing all the sugar cane right there. And, and then round here, oh, <laughs> did you see that lag? Did you see that lag? Why do we have, okay, yeah, I thought that was an extra wall to put in, it isn't. That's fine, that's fine. Let's look at this little bathroom here sponsored by Caleb, Caleb's Poop Place. Thank you so much, Caleb, for your donation. Uh, yeah, everything looks okay. It's fine. We could waterlog these steps here. I think we'd just add that smidgen of detail, which we're looking for. You know, that's a really nice detail, actually, just having those indentations. I really should have thought of doing that all the way along this place. That is actually... Hmm. Hmm. We are kind of lacking a bit of a fence at this canal as well, but I don't think that's too important to have fences along a canal. Canals don't normally have 
fences. Anyway, yeah, paper merchant. This is where they would pulp the paper, mash down all the old paper, recycled paper, and all the bits of wood or whatever they make paper out of. Um, mash it down, powered by the canal. It must be gently flowing, this canal. Okay, it's flowing now, and then this is the paper hanging up to dry. Super simple little place. Uh, what do you think? Um, I haven't done an interior, but I don't do interiors. <laughs> There we go. I think there's one last job to do in this place and that's make a bit of a water a water flow because look the water gets to here. It gets to this part of the hanging gardens and it doesn't actually go anywhere. I wonder if we could bring it down and across. I think I think this is going to be the last job. So the water flows eventually into this system here, but then it doesn't go anywhere. So let's Hmm, how can we do this? Yeah, let's just take it out right here. This is our very last job. Um, maybe we could use... No, let's use some trapdoors. Trapdoors for our water engineering project. Like that. Like that. Like that. That should be... Okay, it needs to be down one level though, doesn't it? Let's just change that into a solid block. Put you there, there, and then we can actually get rid of that one there. That looks okay. Now this is going to drop the water down into a pool roundabout here so we can take this straight across around this tree and then straight out here I think would be a good idea so let's just fill that in and there we go <laughs> straight down straight down there of course of course I've got a bit of a problem here because I made a move earlier on with some of these walkways and I forgot to fill up this little gap here that's annoying to have to do Okay, yep, so I'm going to make this house, this whole island available on my Patreon right now, as it stands, completed, finished as far as I'm concerned, patreon.com forward slash Andy is Yoda, so check that out if you would like a Java edition or a Bedrock edition, there you go, right, and do remember to follow me on Twitch so you can watch the next, can we just flow please, why is, why is the water not flowing? There we go, that should just flow nicely there. Fill this in. And that just completes the whole water cycle, giving us a bit of a flow as well down there. That looks really cool, actually, coming out of there. Chuffed with that. Any more trees to put in? No, I think that is possibly it. Let me see if we can make one or two more trees down here, and that is it. I'm going to sign off on this kingdom. Thank you so much for all your support for this kingdom. I'm going to do one more thing. Oops. Slash tree. I'm going to try and do a cinematic. I'm going to try and do a cinematic of the whole kingdom. But uh, in the meantime, here's a, a quick look back at some of the highlights so far. Thanks for watching. Ciao, ciao. When the blocks be with you. Oh, before you go, before you go, let's just Render distance up. Let's see the whole place. See the whole place finished. Come on, zoom out. Load these chunks. Java edition, <laughs> not the best at loading chunks quickly. Come on, you can do it, server, you can do it. Let's do this. Round and round we go. Are we loading, are we loading? Come on, over here as well. Load up, load up, load up. I wanna see the entire Island. This is what people are waiting for. We have finished. There. This could be my screenshot for my thumbnail. Once all the chunks along that side. Oh, I need these ones to load up as well, just to complete the picture. There we go. One. Finished. Medieval Island. Click.
Welcome Builders, Andy is Jody here. I'm so pumped for this new series. This is season two of Kingdoms, where I build a medieval kingdom, and this time it's gonna be on an island. So welcome to Minecraft Kingdoms. Bit of a kind of a stone bridge, what could be on that? Maybe a wizard's tower, I don't know. I need your ideas. In the last episode, just going off camera there, we did things like healer houses, we did a piggery, we did a sheepery, is that what it's called? We did a lamery, kind of difficult. We've got the uh, sawmill, we've got the hunter's house, we've got the forester. 